it was probably just over just over a year and a half ago. Uh, I ended up having to need to find someone to stay for the night because I ended up needing to kind of skedaddle out of somewhere quickly. So I was going all over the city trying to find somewhere that had an open bed, right? Like kind of city outskirts in, uh, in sort of um, London. And I was going from place to place. But on a Tuesday night, everywhere was full. Premier inns, travel lodges, all right, holiday inns, everywhere didn't have a free bed, okay? Nowhere had a free bed. So I ended up coming to this hotel, which had an, uh, or a motel, sorry, which had a name called like the Royale. And I was like, okay. And like, it, it, it had, it didn't look terrible on the outside. You know, it looked like kind of an apartment block that had been turned into a hotel. And my goodness, I bought a place. I, I should have known, should have known that um, the place wasn't going to be totally copacetic when they asked if I'd like to pay for the night or by the hour, which is, is wild. Uh, pay, do you want to pay for the night or by the hour is, is, is just a great one. Um, so they asked me if I want to pay for the night or by the hour. And I say, uh, I'd like, you know, the night please. And that was great. Uh, so I turn up there. And I start going, they give me the key to my room. I'm in like room 700 and something. Uh, and I go there and the immediate thing when I walk through sort of the doors to the back where the rooms are is I am hit with the overwhelming smell of the devil's lettuce, right? And I'm walking there to the room and I see three things on my way through the stairwell and like along the corridor. People selling the devil's lettuce out of one of the rooms. Uh, individuals of ill repute marketing their services to those passing in the hallways and of course finally someone passed out in the hallway and I go well and the thing is it's a motel but the decor from the inside was like the 1950s so it was like oh great I've ended up in the Hotel Cortez lovely it's American Horror Story so I get in there, the room's terrible, shower doesn't work. Uh, like, I can hear the nocturnal activities of the individuals of the night through the walls. And I end up just sitting there for like seven hours, just sat there waiting for my flight. And honestly, it was like an experience. There was yelling, there was a fight midway through the night. I'm like, this is not, this is not the place for me. 